Hello friends, this is Divya and I am back with another episode of Personalities. Today we are going to talk about a very inspiring personalities, the one who has laid the foundation of Indian space research. We are talking about Vikram Ambalal Sarabhai. Before I begin, I would like to request you to subscribe to my share channel if you haven't yet. Also, it is highly recommended that you join the test series if you haven't yet. It, if you really want to you know, clear this exam, you are really serious about it, do join the test series if you really want to crack it. And uh, do not, do not, do not ever ignore the foundation videos made by Vaish sir because they are the, they are the crucial for your, uh, you know, for your preparation and it clears all your doubt regarding the UPSC preparation and even if you, uh, if you have any genuine doubt, you can clear all those doubts with the, uh, with uh, watching those foundation videos. We are getting many bad, uh, feedback, uh, you know, positive feedbacks regarding the program and uh, many pe uh, students are getting benefited. So if you, if you are, if you want to be the one who is going to clear exam definitely it is recommended that you uh, you know join the test series and watch the foundational videos right so let's begin Vikram Ambalal Sarabhai was an Indian physicist and astronomer he initiated space program and helped develop nuclear power in India with the help of Homi J. Bhabha of course he was honored with Padma Bhushan in 1966 and Padma Vibhushan in 1972 he is internationally regarded as the father of Indian space program now his family and education. He is the son of Ambalal Sarabhai. He came from the famous Sarabhai family from India, who were major industrialists committed to the committed to the Indian independence movement. During his lifetime, he practiced Jainism. He attended Gujarat College in Ahmedabad, but later moved to uh, University of Cambridge, England, where he took his trip in uh, natural sciences in 1940. In 1945, he returned to Cambridge to pursue a PhD and wrote a thesis, Cosmic Ray Investigations in Tropical Latitudes, in 1947. He married classical dancer Mrinalini in 1942 and they had two children. Now, his professional life, known as the cradle of space sciences in India, the Physical Research Laboratory, PRL, was founded in 1947 by Vikram Sarabhai. PRL had a modest beginning at his residence, the retreat with research on cosmic rays. The institute was formally established at the MG Science Institute, Ahmedabad on 11 November 1947 with support from Karmakshetra Educational Foundation and Ahmedabad Education Society. Professor Kalpati Ramakrishna Ramanathan was the first director of the institute. The initial focus was research on cosmic rays and the properties of the upper atmosphere. Research areas were expanded to include theoretical physics and radio physics later with grants from the Atomic Energy Commission. He led the Sarabhai family-owned business conglomerate. His interests varied from science to sports to statistics. He set up Operations Research Group, ORG, the first market research organization in the country. Most notable among the many institutes he helped set up are the Nehru Foundation for Deve Development in Ahmedabad and then IIM Ahmedabad, then Ahmedabad Textile Industries Research Association that is ATIRA and the SEPT. Along with his wife Mrinani Sarabhai, he founded Darpana Academy of Performing Arts. Other projects and in institutions initiated or established by him include fast reader test reactor and we have discussed this about about this in the science lectures do visit those lectures so fast reader test reactor F fbtr in kalpakam tamil Nadu, variable energy cyclo uh, cyclotron project in uh, calcutta then electronics corporation of india limited that is ecil in hyderabad then Ur uranium corporation of india limited ucil in jaduguda jharkhand he started a project for the fabrication and launch of an Indian satellite. As a result, the first Indian satellite, Aryabhat, was put in orbit in 1975 from a Russian cosmodrome. He was the founder of Indian Space Research Organization, that is ISRO. He held many distinguished positions. Now, let's know what are those. He was the president of the physics section of Indian Science Congress, 1962. He was the president of the General Conference of the IAEA Vienna. We, we should know about this body as UPSC aspirants in 1970. And then chairman of the Atomic Energy Commission of India, 1966 to 71. And then vice president of the fourth UN Conference on Peaceful Uses of Atomic Energy, 1971. And then founder and chairman 
from 1963 to 71 of space application center now because of his contribution what are the you know uh, he, uh, he was given some of the, he was named uh, after i mean so many things were named after him let's know what are those so vikram sarabhai space center that is vssc which is in isro's le lead facility for launch vehicle development located in trivandrum tiruvananthapuram is named in his memory this is in kerala so along with other ahmedabad based industrialist he played a major role in setting up of the we know indian institute of management that is im ahmedabad and then indian postal department department released a commemorative postal stamp on his first first death anniversary that is on 30 december 1972 in 1973 the international astronomical union decided that a lunar crater bessel a in the sea of serenity will be known as the sarabhai crater the lander on india's moon mission that is chandrayaan 2 which was to land near the uh, south pole of the moon on september 20 2009 but it could not the landing was not soft and it hard landed was named after vikram in his honor vikram a sarabhai community science center located in ahmedabad gujarat is named after him of course and then vikram sarabhai established this institute around the 1960s former world quiz champion vikram joshi was named after him a space museum was dedicated to him at bm that is birla science Mu science center hyderabad on 26 july 2019 the museum was curated by pranav sharma isro's rocket engine that is vikas engine is named after him on his 100th birthday of on 12th august 2019 the isro announced an award in the name of vikram sarabhai the vikram sarabhai journalism award in space science technology and research will be given to those journalists who have contributed to the field of space science application and research you should watch the movie rocketry it is very inspiring very good movie and I highly recommend uh, you to watch that movie and it has given you know quite a brief about the history of our space research and about vikram sarabhai as well and you can watch the interviews of you know apj dr apj abdul kalam how he praises vikram sarabhai so is unfortunate uh, unfortunate death now on 30 december 1971 vikram sarabhai was to review the slv space launch vehicle design before his departure departure for bombay the same night he had spoken to apj abdul kalam on the telephone and within an hour of the conversation vikram sarabhai died at the age of 52 due to cardiac arrest in trivandrum his body body was cre cremated in ahmedabad and we lost him forever so with this we have come and end to this episode hope you enjoyed it and if you really did do like and share these videos as much as you can we'll meet in the next one keep watching the videos